Welcome to the tutorial about Stinger transitions with Creatomid.eu. If you don't have seen the first video about the general principles of the macro generator, please check that one first and then come back to this video. If you like our Supersource macro generators, you will find the DSK Stinger generator useful, too. This one is simpler to fill in, but you have to prepare more for the usage. But first, we want to see a Stinger transition, so that you know what you will build here. And another one. And back with the first one. Great. These transitions rely on a hyperdeck source for the video. We do use cheap Raspberry Pi mini computers with Playout B to create the effect without huge investments. You will find links to that below. Our Stinger videos are done with Premiere and After Effects, but you can create them with your video program or download existing ones somewhere. It is important that the parts that are displaying the sources below must be black. And the parts hiding the videos below have to be at least some dark gray to not shine through. And in the exact middle of the animation, they must cover the whole screen for a few frames to hide the cut to the destination source input. See the description in the assistant for more information on that and load the video to the hyperdeck or playout B. And then define the macro, set the input device, file and HDMI port. Select which downstream key you want to use and to which input you want the transition to cut. On the right side select the length of the transition in frames and define the delay for loading the video on start. Try 10 frames for that at start. Save the macro as useful to a place in the Artem Mini and proceed to the next step with the OK button. Thank you for your attention. Please also see the other videos in this series, subscribe to our channel and go to Discord or the forums here for any question. You will find useful links below. We wish you much fun using the creatomy.eu macros on your Artem switcher.